Okay, here we're gonna show you how to measure a motor. Sometimes uh, trying to find a compatible motor for something where a tag's rubbed off or um, your model just doesn't exist anymore. Sometimes we need to take some measurements to know which motor's gonna work for you. So I'm gonna show you quickly how to do that. So this right here is a double bolt motor, just like we have in the recliner behind us. But if you wanna tell us what it is, what we want you to do is we want you to go like this and we want you just to measure kind of end to end on this one. So we're 20 and three quarters on this one. So that's how we'd measure this one. On this one, sometimes even if you want to just take a picture of it like this in your picture and send a picture like it with the, the tape measure laying next to it, that helps us. But you can measure here. Here we want to measure this is fully closed end to end um, what it measures over here. So that's end, so, so about 19 inches. Sometimes you can just measure right here. That helps us as well. Uh, you know, 14 and three quarters inches, that helps. Same idea on this one right here. This one has a clevis on one side, a bolt. We don't actually use the bolts here, but we'll still measure it anyway. And this one's 17 inches. But anyway, just putting a tape measure next to all of these and then taking a picture actually is very helpful for us to be able to know what a current compatible motor is for you. Like I said, um, if your, motor, your motor's old and uh, it's not being made anymore, it doesn't mean all is lost. It just means we need to help you try and find one that is the current compatible motor. And that's what we can do here. We have a wonderful customer service staff who's very knowledgeable about all these parts that can help you. So give us a call at greatfurniturdeal.com. We'd love to help you find the right part to fix.